Hi, my name is Lindsay. Welcome to Love Them Well Homeschool. I am so glad you're here today because I wanna show you the things that I bought at my first homeschool convention that I just went to last weekend. It was so much fun. And I got some really cool stuff that I wanna share with you. First of all, this shirt, Teaching My Tribe. There is a company called Shirts Galore and More, and they are local to me, but they ship all over the United States, maybe even internationally. But I wanted to show you guys these shirts. Most of the shirts that I wear are their shirts. They are friends with my neighbors and they're really sweet people and they make the best shirts and they homeschool so they understand. And there are some really funny shirts they make one of them at the conference said, keeping homeschooling weird. It was so cute. I didn't get that one because they didn't have my size anymore. And I highly recommend these shirts. They're super soft. I have had some of them for a year now and I wear them like every day and they're still beautiful colors. They, they fit so well. So I want to promote them, shirts galore and more, and I will link them below. I was really excited to meet Millie Florence. She is the author of a couple books that she has written. She's a homeschool student. I don't know how old she is, but she is not out of high school yet. And she has written these beautiful books. Now I've read the first chapter of this so far. I'm blown away by how well it is written. And she signed it for my daughter. Getting to meet her was a delight because she was so sweet. And it gave me so much hope for the things that my kids can do when we homeschool and we have time. When I was walking through the vendor fair at the convention, I saw so many kinds of curriculum, like anything you can think of it was there except gather around. But all of these big name curriculums are there. They're supporting their stuff by having it there and they're showing you different things. And then you walk by these vendors who are homeschool moms who have started a business and they have these amazing products. And I couldn't pass this one up. In fact, my friend over at Thrifty Homeschool also bought the same exact product, only it's a different poster, but I'm gonna link her channel below, Tony's channel, because she shows the poster for the Vander Beakers. I think that's what the name of the book is called. Anyway, I want you to see that poster too. But her booth, first of all, this lady's booth was amazing. Her company is called Ruby Reads Books and she has these read aloud posters. I'm linking her site below and I'll show you the poster that I got, which is for the book, The Miraculous Journey of Edward Tulane. Now, let me tell you about this book. We read this two years ago as one of our read alouds and it was so good. By the end, I was bawling. And then a couple weeks ago, my daughter said, remember that that movie we watched that one time about the bunny and I, th I thought what movie did we watch about a bunny and she's telling me this story about this movie we watched and then finally I realized she was talking about this book that's how well written this book is it was so ingrained in her mind the pictures that the words told that she thought we had watched a movie about this and we hadn't it's this book Kate DiCamillo she's amazing but this story in particular is awesome so that's why I got this poster one of the main speakers there was Pam Barnhill and I love her. She does the morning basket stuff. I will link her. She is so sweet. And so she passed me and I'm like, you know, geeking out a little bit. And she was like, I like your hair. And I, and I, you know, once I found my words, I was like, I like your hair too. And then we started talking and then the rest of the convention, we would see each other around and it was just so much fun. I felt like I had made a friend. Anyway, I got her book better together a couple years ago from the library, but I went ahead and bought my own. I need to have this book myself so I can write in it. It's a really good book. Bring delight back into your homeschool, strengthen your family, simplify your homeschool and savor the subjects that matter most. Definitely good to inspire you for homeschool. She also writes the perfect book for homeschooling. If you are in your first or second year of homeschooling, this is really important. It lays out everything you need to know and it has all of the organizers in here that you can write in. Even though I have already been homeschooling for several years, this was a really good refresher for me. I read through the whole thing throughout the conference and it's really good. So I highly recommend this, especially if you just need help getting organized in your homeschool. 
I also was honored to meet Colleen Kessler. She wrote this book here, Raising Resilient Sons. She also has a website called Raising Lifelong Learners. It's excellent and you should definitely check it out. But she was delightful. She was really sweet to meet and I was excited to buy her book too. So one thing that I ordered at the fair was a math manipulative and it is a place value holder. And I love this because when we're doing place value, it's all over the table. It's kind of hard to organize. I saw this and thought immediately, this is something I could really use. So the guy that I ordered it from even was the one that made it. He printed it off of a 3D printer. He was really nice. I will link his stuff below because my friend Abby uses their math curriculum and it's all about manipulatives and using your hands and learning through doing with math. You should definitely check out their curriculum if you need some hands-on math manipulatives and a curriculum that explains things for you. They are fantastic. So this is what I bought at the convention. I was so excited for my purchases. I feel like everything is really useful and I hope you enjoyed seeing what I got. Again, don't forget to check out my friend Tony's video below because she went to a convention the weekend before me. It was a different convention, but there were some of the same vendors there and it was funny because we bought some of the same stuff. So that was kind of cool. All right, I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.